All right, welcome back to another 52 Licks. We spent the last couple of rounds uh, talking about some great underrated masters from the past. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that. Now we're going to um, talk about some, uh, basically some masters of today, some phenomenal players uh, that uh, people will be talking about decades from now, just like we talked about those guys. So first guy we're going to hit is Kendrick Scott. Monster player, great composer. He's got a couple of great records out. He's obviously been uh, a sideman on tons and tons of records. Um, I found this little clip on YouTube uh, of him uh, doing a little live set. Uh, trading. Phenomenal stuff. There's one particular lick that I wanted to zero in in. Let's check on that lick. So if you saw my first round of 52 licks, I did a Kendrick Scott lick that's pretty similar to this. So this one kind of caught my ear again. Uh, it might be something if you want to go back and check out that Kendrick Scott lick, you can kind of connect them and hear this kind of cool sound that he likes to, to deal with. There's a couple things about the lick itself that speak to me. It's a it's a nine note phrase uh, in, in uh, triplets. So it's going to take up three beats. Kind of reminds me of those old Philly Joe um, uh, nine stroke phrases that he would play at fast tempos. So, but let's break down the lick itself. So just hands only first, he's going to play paradiddle first. Remember, so much of this uh, year-long series is, is based on finding cool ways to um, vary the paradiddle. So here's one. Paradiddle and then a left, right, right. So... Now, we're going to add uh, the, other, the last two notes are going to come with two bass drum notes. That's the whole phrase, except... Obviously, what he does with the stick-on-stick stick stuff, that's really what kind of brings it to life. But sticking-wise and rhythm-wise, that's all there is to it. So, what is he doing stick-on-stick? Stick? So, for the most part, he's playing, I say for the most part, for a reason in a minute. So, regular, uh, regular right, then mute into the drum, two stick shots, another mute, two more stick shots. Now, what he does occasionally is he'll pick that left, that first left back up. So we actually get a, a stick click like this. To me, that's one of the like subtle things that he doesn't do it every single time when I hear him play this phrase, but he, he does do it a lot. It's a cool little variation. Now, on the PDF, I've got a whole bunch of variations of this phrase, some including that, that stick click, some not. Also, break, you know, we talked about that kind of Philly Joe sound where, where we kind of loop every three beat. You can play the phrase. You don't even have to do it in stick shot. So lots of like variations like that, but super hip lick. Uh, again, paradiddle based. Uh, just a matter of kind of putting a little cool voicing on it and obviously uh, practicing it to where it's effortless the way Kendrick plays it. Okay, see you on the next one. Good luck.